6. The Spirit Mind The eternal Son is spirit and has mind, but not a mind or a spirit which mortal mind can comprehend. Mortal man perceives mind on the finite, cosmic, material, and personal levels. Man also observes mind phenomena in living organisms functioning on the subpersonal, animal level. But it is difficult for him to grasp the nature of mind when associated with supermaterial beings and as a part of exclusive spirit personalities. Mind must, however, be differently defined when it refers to the spirit level of existence and when it is used to denote spirit functions of intelligence. That kind of mind which is directly allied with spirit is comparable neither to that mind which coordinates spirit and matter, nor to that mind which is allied only with matter. Spirit is ever conscious, minded, and possessed of varied phases of identity. Without mind in some phase, there would be no spiritual consciousness in the fraternity of spirit beings. The equivalent of mind, the ability to know and be known, is indigenous to deity. Deity may be personal, prepersonal, superpersonal, or impersonal, but deity is never mindless, that is, never without the ability at least to communicate with similar entities, beings, or personalities. The mind of the Eternal Son is like that of the Father, but unlike any other mind in the universe, and with the mind of the Father it is ancestor to the diverse and far-flung minds of the conjoint Creator. The mind of the Father and the Son, that intellect which is ancestral to the absolute mind of the third source and center, is perhaps best illustrated in the pre-mind of a thought adjuster, for, though these father fragments are entirely outside of the mind circuits of the conjoint actor, they have some form of pre-mind, they know as they are known, they enjoy the equivalent of human thinking. The Eternal Son is wholly spiritual. Man is very nearly entirely material. Therefore, much pertaining to the spirit personality of the Eternal Son, to his seven spiritual spheres encircling Paradise, and to the nature of the impersonal creations of the Paradise Son, will have to await your attainment of spirit status following your completion of the Marancha Ascension of the local universe of Nevadon. And then, as you pass through the super-universe and on to Havona, many of these spirit-concealed mysteries will clarify as you begin to be endowed with the mind of the spirit, spiritual insight. <laughs>